it's one o'clock and it's time for a drink. Dum de dum de dum dum dum. When the sun beats down and I lie on the bench, I can always hear them talk. Yes, I've only had one drink tonight. Honest to God, this is still the same scotch from the last radio. It's the only one I've had all night. So you guys know that I mentioned in the previous video that uh, I got the Rune uh, three-month trial the day the Harmon announcement came out. Never got my wish about them dropping the price down because of it, so whatever. Guess what I did today? I bought the fucking the Rune lifetime subscription. Went on a monthly payment plan through Klarna because um, I... I'm not, I, you guys probably seen it in my community uh, uh, post there in the forums. I wouldn't fucking throw 800, 800 and change down on this and dump it on my credit card or take it out of my debit account. You know, I, I got bills to pay like everybody else, right? It's fucking stupidity. But I fucking got to admit, I mean, I love this fucking platform. I fucking everybody, you know, my buddy Mr. Chibs up there in um, t t Toronto. Toronto, it's not Toronto. Anyhow, he swears by the fucking thing. Dave Snyder swears by it. I, I thought all these guys were fucking crazy, right? And I got other people in my in the club here, the, the AZAV club. They're year, yearly subscribers. They think it's the best thing since sliced fucking bread and whatever. Well, after, you know... I know this thing, the last thing I want is, oh, by the way, I'll be at the Florida uh, um, ex Expo, Audio Expo next next week. Um, I'll be in Leo's room, and I'll also be hanging around the Black Ice guys. You know, I, I have, my, my priorities are fucked. You guys know that. Well, I got this thing. Now, the only thing I don't like about Rune is, yes, the... The direct stream DAC, obviously, it's one of the you know many compatible devices, as is the Blue Sound node. But I've basically got my PCM USB uh, um, solid state drive plugged into the the Mac, which you can't see because the fucking I couldn't get it to show up. But anyways, it's plugged into the Mac. So is the four terabyte um, flash drive for all my DSD files that used to be plugged into here. And I'll be quite honest, I mean, I've got so many fucking DSD files now accumulated since 2018, basically, when I had the Marantz SR5011. One of these days I'll do a video on that experience. Um, between those files that I've bought, got in other methods, and then all the LP rips that I've been doing, it's a lot of fucking folders to go through on this even, you know. I mean, before it wasn't a big issue, but now I'm like, I'm scared of wearing, wearing the remote out on my Sony, even though I've got it duplicated on my phone with the Broadlink app for the for the remote control, the universal remote control. And yeah, I mean, I'm never going to use, I know there's a DSD upslampler and all kinds of crazy crap, and there, Dave Snyder showed us at the club some room correction stuff that you can do with, with room equalization wizard and you can put the parameters in. I don't, my room, my DSP is my room treatment. You know, I, you can't use DSP when you're listening to DSD files anyways. Um, but yeah, as fucking as much as I hate to admit it, those motherfuckers, they got my fucking money and then, and then some. Well, Klarna got the, they're going to get the fucking interest, but it's going to cost me 50 bucks a month for the next 18 months. I can manage that. I just can't, I couldn't justify paying 150 bucks a year for this stupid thing. That's just fucking dipshit, fucking batshit crazy, you know. Um, and yeah, I, I mean, it's got all that crazy deep dive stuff into artists and related artists. But I like the fact that it's as seamless to use here as my Blue Sound Node is, which I still use for Amazon Music, right? That's the only thing I'm using the Blue Sound for now, is so I can do uh, bit-perfect streaming of Amazon Music, right? You'll never see Cobuzz on here, what the fuck for? It would be nice 
if Amazon Music was on here, but again, I've got the blue sound for that. And, you know, shout out to my friend Mike once again. Um, I still owe you that DSD rip, which, as you guys can see, my PS Audio Stellar Phono preamp um, is out at the service uh, bay over at PS Audio in Boulder. Um, had some weird shit happening the same weekend I did the video on the lamb. Um, even with the, my, my friend Ben lent me a, a Cambridge Audio uh, moving coil preamp j just so I could listen to my vinyl on. It's nothing special, trust me. Um, there's some reviews out there. This is the one that's got both moving magnet and moving coil on it. Um, it hums a little bit, but whatever, you know, it's, it's a cheap phono preamp. It's, it's a loner. I appreciate the fact that he lent it to me, but, uh, you know, I'm not going to rave about it that it's the next thing since sliced bread. No, but yeah, the, the guys got it over at the factory and then I find out it still had three months of warranty left on it. So they're basically going to refresh it like as, as if it was new and all it's going to cost me was shipping to Boulder, which was 30 bucks. Um, Another thing, too, I'm starting to get some interest in my vinyl stuff that I've been putting on disc, uh, Discogs. Um, but I got the whole shipping thing. I'm still trying to figure it out. I'm, I'm a newbie at that crap. I, I know I'm going to get, I'm going to lose money on the first few sales. It's the story of my life. Anyway, another tangent that I went off on. So, yeah, Rune, don't fucking pay the $150 a year. Go on one of those fucking financing plans. Get the fucking lifetime. You might as well because, I mean, the beauty is where Ottervana fucked me up the ass when my hard drive crashed two years ago and they wouldn't let me reinstall what I'd paid for, right? These guys, at least I know if something like that, God forbid, happens, right? At least I know all I got to do is show them the license key they'll let me download whatever's there because with Rune, you get unlimited updates. You know, basically, you know, it's taken care of. Whereas with Ottervana, if you don't have a certain version, you're SOL, dude, shit out of luck. Hey, there's there's an acronym that I know real well. So yeah, guys, um, that's the last one of the bunch. You know, hopefully you tolerated the last three and this was the last one. Cheers, guys. Have a good rest of your weekend. Fini.